three wins are required, Giannis. We've seen the first win on an outside. Should Leonidas be Brian Shaw's first opponent? Guys, as we know, a few weeks ago, we had East vs. West 14, on which, on the co-main event, we had John Brzenk versus Leonidas Arcona. And on the match, we could see that Leonidas' technique did advance, since he managed to get John's wrist. But even so, it hasn't advanced enough for him to climb up to a press, which led him into getting flop press in all the rounds, resulting in Leonidas having his very first loss on a professional arm wrestling match. And now, Leo is heading towards a match against none other than Devon Larratt, although it will be a left-handed match. But if we just stop to think about it, Leonidas only had three wins on his professional career, two against Larry Wheels on both arms and one against Schoolboy on the right arm. And now, he has one loss on the right arm, and probably, if he don't really involve until the 28th of September, he'll have his first loss on the left arm as well. So, you know, if we actually take a look, Leonidas is a guy who has a bit of time on the sport, and has gathered a bit of experience. And Brian Shaw is someone who many are asking when is he going to be his first match, and who it would be against. And many talk about matching Brian with Leonidas, since both are upcoming athletes in the sport. Although, there's a few things to consider. First of all, as much as it isn't much, Leonidas has already a bit of table time and a bit of technique gathered, while Brian don't. But at the same time, Brian weighs 60 kilos more than Leonidas, so it sort of would be the same as seeing Devon vs. Levon if we're comparing in size, not to talk about Brian's leverage. And how I think that match would go, well, we've already seen that Brian's tendencies are to be a flop presser. We've seen many times him just wanting to go on that lane, and Schoolboy has flop pressed Leonidas. So, to think that Brian wouldn't have a stronger press than Schoolboy, to me, is just unrealistic. But also, I don't know what would happen if Leonidas would dominate Brian's hand and get him on the same position as John on their match. Just an awesome amount of possible outcomes that, to me, makes it worth it a match of them. But what about you guys? Would you like to see that match? Leave that in the comments, and thank you so much for watching.